the recording? Mm -hmm. Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Tonight I'm going to show you how to get Xfinity Stream Go for your Fire Stick TV. It's really simple. You just go to Settings, My Fire TV, Developer Options, and make sure that you have ADB bugging and also apps for unknown sources both turned on. Then you're going to go back and go to download, or we're going to download Downloader. I already have it, so <laughs> anybody else just go to Downloader. Should just type a couple letters and it'll come up. Downloader. This one's taking forever. Work. And here it is right here, Downloader. That's where I go to download all of my apps. Um, so we're gonna click on this and we're gonna type in, let me clear it all out so you can see exactly what I'm typing in. We're gonna type in HTTP apps dot Kinte.net, so K-I-N-T-E, Kinte, oops, dot net. Okay, and then from here, you're going to want to download the mouse toggle, which I already have. Make sure you have a mouse toggle. And then also, we're looking for the XFND right here, newer vision, version, download that. And also, We're looking for an explorer, so let's get let's get Chrome. I already have that downloaded, but you want to make sure you download that. Once this is downloading, the mouse toggle needs to be downloaded, and also the Xfinity. And they download really quickly. And once again, you guys, this is for X Xfinity Stream. Go. So whatever channels they have for Go, you'll be able to watch at any time. As long as you have an Xfinity account or know somebody's Xfinity account information, you'll be able to use the Xfinity Stream app. Mine's installing pretty slow right now. I already have the mouse toggle and Xfinity and everything installed to mine. I'm just showing you how to install one of the things that we need. I 
and it is going very slow. Normally it doesn't take this long. Make if you already got it. Yeah. And then you want to go to install. So make sure that you install the Xfinity, the updated one, the Google Chrome, or whichever explorer you like to use, and also the mouse toggle. The mouse toggle is the most important for the Xfinity um, stream app. And then done. And then you can delete it since we already installed it, and then delete again. Then we're going to go back to the home screen. And as you can see, I already have Xfinity to mine. So what you're going to want to do is log in on Xfinity, whichever Xfinity account credentials you have, you can log in. And you always have to use a mouse toggle on this app. But you get almost every channel, movies, um, whatever is on the Go channels, and it works pretty good. Like right now, I'll go to if my mouse toggle will work. My mouse toggle is not working, but. It should be pretty easy for you to enter your cred credentials and you can log in and then Xfinity Stream will be ready to go. Thank you.